millions of Americans have allergies. And we're told that these allergies, well, we're going to have to live with them. They're fixed allergies or they're seasonal or cyclic allergies. However, I find that most allergies are really due to a lowered immune system. Well, what happens when you have a lowered immune system? You get autoimmune disease. So it's common to have people have arthritis and all kinds of food sensitivities. What do we do about that? We do this. We go on an elimination diet to eliminate the allergen. That's number one. Then we supercharge our immune system with things like vitamin C, quercetin, bilberry extract, red clover as a tea, which is great, and watermelon juice, cabbage juice, outstanding for our system, magnesium, calcium, and manganese, and zinc. Great for allergies, builds up the immune system, and three or four months down the road, those peanuts you couldn't eat, the almonds you couldn't eat, now you'll be able to. As the immune system comes up, I find that allergies go down. Well, the most common allergens are wheat, dairy, corn, beef, sugar, yeast, sometimes soy, and chocolate. Now, these are items we have almost every single day in our diet in some form. How do we know what we're allergic to? How do we know if we're allergic to corn or nuts or apples? There's a very inexpensive and easy way to do this. You can do this on your own. It's called the Coco Pulse Test. On an empty stomach, when you're in bed, do not get out of bed. Take your pulse for 60 seconds. Then take a single item of food and put it under your tongue for about 20 seconds and put it out. Stay in bed. Don't do anything that would raise your pulse. 20 minutes later, take your pulse again. If your pulse has gone up five beats or more per minute, there's a high probability you're allergic to that. Now, that allergy may manifest as a headache, mood swings, if it's to the brain. It may manifest as a fatigue overall, or a brain fog, where you just can't get clear on your thoughts. If it's an allergy in your intestines or stomach, it could be gastrointestinal disturbances, gas, bloating, diarrhea. In your joints, it could be arthritis or weakness in the calves or mut muscles. Now, test all of the different items you commonly eat, which will probably take about two weeks each day to do. Then all those items that cause your pulse to go up, eliminate them for five days. At the end of five days, take your pulse again in the morning and see what it's at. And you'll see that you can actually choose the items that you're allergic to, eliminate them from your system, and that means you're eliminating the underlying allergies and bringing back up your immune system. It's easy.